Let's look at how we can calculate a correlation in Excel 2016 for Mac. Now here we have Beep Beep's bedtime snacks, uh, the data that we have. So here's, here's Beep Beep, he wants to say hi again. Hello. Now what we want to do is we want to calculate a single value that describes how closely these numbers are related to, and this is called the Pearson Correlation Coefficient, or we just call it correlation, and the symbol for it is R. The way we're going to do it is with the Data Analysis Tool Pack. So we go to Data, and it uh, here's the data analysis. If you don't have the data analysis installed, it's free and you need to uh, watch the video on how to, to do that. So I click data analysis and I am going to go to correlation. I choose correlation and it says the input range. And what we want to do is we want to do all the columns of all the numbers that we want to correlate. Here we've just got two variables. So I'm going to copy the entire table. It's grouped by columns. Each variable is in one column. The labels are in the first row, cookies and coke. Those are the names of the variables. Now the output range, I am going to um, put it next to it. Now notice that when I clicked on output range, the highlighted cell went up to input range, so I need to click in the output range. And now I can put like D4, and that's where the output will be. I press OK, and we have some numbers that need rounding, first of all, because that's too many decimal points. So I'm going to go to, well, the whole table that it created is highlighted. I'm going to go to Home, and I'm going to go to the Number section, and under the format, I'm going to choose Number, and there it's rounded everything off to two decimal points. Now, notice how it lists all the variables in this column and all the variables in this row, and it tells what, how the variables are related to each other. So Coke is always perfectly related to Coke. When he has one can of Coke, he has one can of Coke. So all the variables in the diagonal, even if we had more, di more variables, would always be one. But the cookies and Coke are very strongly related negatively, as co the negative sign means that as Coke the number of cans of Coke goes up, one, two, three. The number of cookies go down, eight, seven, three. And it's minus 0.94. So minus one is as, as strong as it can get. So this is strongly a strong negative correlation between cookies and Coke.